It's the Geeky Cooking Show! Okay, now we have already done a tremendous thing for this new recipe. This is the first time we're actually baking something, my sister's request. Um, we've already, it's already taken an hour to shred all of these, and we have shredded them ourselves. Look at our compost. Um, so the recipe calls for three cups finely peeled, well, it's carrot cake, that's what the recipe is. And it called for three cups finely shredded carrot, but we peeled it because we don't have enough carrots right now, and my mom didn't want to go shopping. So now we have to get flour two cups of flour um, into a mixing bowl. Okay, and two cups now. Here's the second cup. Now it calls for two cups of sugar. So I'm going to have my assistant measure the sugar, the two cups of sugar into the thing. I don't know how to do that, Kiki. Okay, I am teaching her new things. All right. So I'll do the first cup for you. Here's what you get. You pour very slowly. Oops. See, sometimes even chefs make mistakes. Actually, so next time you should just go like that. Well. Okay, to make it easier, we'll do one and a half cup, and then we'll do another one and a half cup. Oh no, you don't have to do that with this one. You just have to shake it. That's one half cup, and this will make a cup. No, 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 don't try to get away. You're going to be doing the other two half cups. Let me just brush all the sugar that I missed into here. Good job. We washed our hands, by the way. We are professionals. Okay, so now do. Okay. Shake it a little bit. 
by the way, extra baking soda is okay. Just a little bit of extra though. already greased these pans ready for baking but this will take a while so we're gonna end it shortly not now but soon um one teaspoon ground cinnamon we have it right here you can get ground cinnamon in Trader Joe's which is where we got ours now Oh, and this is all out of the random, but you should go to Shadoni.com. It's a great place. What are we, the sponsors or something? Yeah. Yes, we spon Shidoni sponsors us, so go there. Okay, now you're going to dip it in. And we might sponsor random things that we like, but you don't have to like it, but we just do. creating a mess, but I will clean it up. Okay, that was one teaspoon ground cinnamon. Um, soon we're going to do, oh, then we're going to add the carrot, oil, and eggs. Hooray! So, now it is time to add the three cups finally, not shredded, peeled carrots into the mixing bowl. That's a lot. And it took about like an hour to peel nine carrots, I guess. Um, one cup cooking oil. Okay. We're using vegetable, which is the exact same as cooking, as you chefs may know. One cup of oil, that's a lot. But I'm following the recipe. Eggshells, try to get them out with your fingers. Don't need to be sorry. There, there are no mistakes in cooking. No. There are no accidents in cooking. Mistakes can also be good mistakes. And then they make the thing that you're making better. So, yeah. I'm gonna see how much time it is right now. Okay, it has been nine minutes, so we will just end it here. Um, make sure to add the rest of the eggs, the rest of the one egg, and then pour into two greased and floured nine times one and a half inch round baking pans. Bake in a 350 degree oven for 30 to 35 minutes or till a toothpick inserted near the center comes out clean. Cool on wire racks for 10 minutes. 
Okay, and and that's all. That's all. That's all.